Looking for a good one? Find some next time this week's picks from Sega and Loki. Kids, you, you can, can do, do it. it! Okay, this is... Today I am a robot. Today I am a robot. Why did you like this one? Because it has robots in it. Right. You know what I like? What? That the girl is a robot. You hardly ever get to see girls as robots. Yeah. yeah. You hardly get to see a female as a robot. Right. Except you know, Miss Elena sometimes. But hardly ever. So this was pretty cool. Wait. No wait. Is it backwards? Nope. It has the same same thing on the front and the back sort of. It's a full spread but it has the same words. Okay. What, uh, what's this one and what was your favorite part? The song. The song? What is it? Where the Buffalo Road. You, you like it because it's a song? Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, next. This one red, is red, red, red. And what was your favorite part about this one? Um, the sunset. The sunset. I think you just spoiled the book. It's still fun to get there, though. Everybody's wondering why he's gotta go look at something red. They all think they have it, but they don't. Yes. This book is love from a very hungry caterpillar. Right. This is a good Valentine book. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Especially if you like Eric Carl and Eric Carl's artwork. If you give a mouse a brownie. Okay. What is your favorite part of this book? My favorite part of this book is... The same thing with all these books probably, that it comes around in a full circle. And mouse! Mouse! Yeah! Mouse! Oh, where'd he go? Where'd he go? <laughs> I got the mouse! No, you didn't. You were like... Hey. I, can't, I can't reach all the way over there. I'm kind of stuck over on this side. <laughs> Hi, mouse. Didn't I'm you? not going to eat you. You're wearing overalls. I wouldn't eat you anyway. The magic beans. The magic beans. Why did you like this one? Because it had magic beans. Right, you are sort of mildly obsessed with the idea of magic beans. Yeah. Right. Like Zack and the Beans. I, I think that magic beans are Sagan's favorite magical item. And yeah. It, probably because of poison boots, right? Yeah. He even calls eggs humpties. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing wrong with poison boots. Okay, next. Ah! <laughs> Blue hat, green hat. Blue hat, green hat. This is like an early reader. Yeah. Right. And what did you like about this one? It was it was like well I'll read you some of it. Okay. Blue hat, green hat, red hat. Oops. His <laughs> oops is in it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, because the 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 chicken puts puts his hat on on for his socks. Right. So this appeals this is not just for little kids, even though it's an early reader. It's yeah. it, it appeals to more ages than just little kids. Yeah. Red sir, blue sir, yellow sir, oops. <laughs> he the chicken the chicken <laughs> silly chicken. The chicken puts a dessert for his pants. Oh, Yellow pants for pants, green pants. Oops. I, I think it's a turkey. Yeah. Yeah, it's a turkey, not a chicken. Blue coat. Oops. Next book is Clark the Shark. Clark the Shark. What was cool about Clark the Shark? Bat. Bat. That's but besides that, he was a shark, but he had wiggles, right? You have wiggles. Your mom has wiggles. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And and Clark the Shark has so many wiggles it makes him unpopular, but then he learns how to how to focus, right? Yeah. He uses rhymes to focus. And rhymes doesn't work for everybody, but usually there's some kind of key that helps you focus. Right? Right. So this was a book about how to focus. Yeah. 
and it was always very useful. Okay. Okay. The next book. Next book. Oh, this is your favorite of the week. Yeah. Right? This was great. We've read this before. Yeah. What did? What was your favorite part of this? My favorite part of this. Oh wait, first say what it is. Mummy cat. Mummy cat. What is your favorite part of mummy cat? Well, because it's a cat. Well, it is a cat. Hey, and look on the back. I know it looks like a Loki cat. It looks no, like a Loki no, cat. No, 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 no. Hey, mouse! There's a mouse there. There's a mouse throughout the book. If you have a cat that likes to jump on a mouse in the book, there's so many mouses. So many. Hey, but, anyway. and mouse. But look, look at the picture. Doesn't it look like? Doesn't it look like your mama Loki? I mean me. Look, turn around the back. Three, two, one, action. Doesn't that look like your mom and me? Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. And anyway, what happens in this story? It, it's about a cat who died. Oh, yeah, the cat died. He got stung by a scorpion and so did his queen. Yeah. Right. It, that was a sad part, but it's okay. It's, it's a happy ending, the, sort of. Yeah. It was like mommy to mommy. Right. It's we don't want to give away the ending, but it is it is a bittersweet story. Yeah. And they they do end up dying, but they are mummies. But um and the sister, boy, she was bad. Yeah, right? yeah. There's a jealous sister and if you like Egyptian artwork, this is a very good story. It's Yeah, yeah. It even has the hieroglyphs in it and they're correct. Yeah. Right, right, right. Oh, wait, wait. Okay. Meow is bottle of milk. And I think that's a feather and a bird. It's a it's a papyrus leaf. But um, yeah. mew is how you say it, and that's the word for cat in Egyptian. But usually. The M is an owl, yeah. but oh, when they do cat, they use the M for milk, because it's a cat. Why would you use an owl if there was a milk available? Yeah, oh, and, oh, and, 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 and in the cat, you, 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 you cover up the, the, the cat picture, and right. then it's meow, meow. Right, because the cat picture says that it's a noun. Kind of. It, yeah, it, it's meow, but with a cat picture at the end. Right, because the cat picture at the end is called a determinative. Yeah. Yeah, and it tells you what the rest of the word is about. Yeah. Yeah, because there's no vowels. It's really hard to explain, but yeah. it's fun. Yeah. It sounds itself to read. Kids, you, you can, can do, do it! it. What's the first one? Bless you. Hey guys, it's Loki. Thanks for your likes and comments and shares. Don't forget to have your parents hit that notification bell when you subscribe so you can get more kid-approved homeschool and after-school ideas from Sagan and Loki. And so your parents can get their me time. Let's be friends.